Hello Gates Trally, this is Superintendent Christopher Daly with the May 21st update on our COVID-19 school closure. A reminder that schools are closed for the remainder of the school year and at-home learning continues. The governor still hasn't decided about summer school. We expect to learn more about that later this month. In the meantime, this week we finalized plans for the end of our at-home instruction. The last day for new content instruction will be Wednesday, June 10th. The last day for student attendance at online meetings and or turning in assignments will be Tuesday, June 16th. And the last day for our 10-month employees will be Thursday, June 18th. Our end-of-year events will be modified to accommodate the current restrictions in place. This includes commencement for our class of 2020, which is still set for Wednesday, June 24th. Plans for graduation and other completion ceremonies will be shared directly with the families of those students. This week, you should have received a postcard in the mail with a few details about our upcoming school budget vote and board election. We invite you to join us for a virtual budget hearing this coming Tuesday, May 26th at 6 p.m. Also next week, we'll be sharing a link to a virtual Meet the Candidates night so you, the community, can meet our five candidates running for a seat on your Board of Education. In the days following our budget hearing, you'll be receiving the budget issue of our district newsletter. In it, you will find details about our budget, information about this year's board candidates, and the many successes and achievements that make up our collective GC pride. Remember, our vote is scheduled for Tuesday, June 9th. As I mentioned, we'll be mailing each district household two ballots. If you know that you will need more than two, please contact our district clerk or go to gateschilet.org slash vote to complete the form to request additional ballots. A quick reminder that the district is closed this coming Monday, May 25th, in observance of Memorial Day, which means there will be no meal pickup that day. Meals were provided for Saturday at this Friday's pickup. As we move into the holiday weekend, let's take pause to remember the men and women in our community and far beyond who have lost their lives defending our freedom. Even though our Memorial Day parades and events are canceled for safety reasons, we can still honor and pay tribute to these brave servicemen and women. Please continue to wash your hands frequently. Practice social distancing and wear a mask if you must go out. Go Spartans!